Hey everybody, this is Casey from CaseyFriday.com. So you want to sell something on Craigslist, but you don't want to use the cheap photo uploader that they have on their website. Well, there's an easy way to get around that. I choose to use Google's Picasa Photo Manager because it's easiest for me and I like Google products. Um, and basically, if you're running on a Mac, you've got two options. If you're running on a Windows PC, you've got other options, but the two that I'm going to show you here today, um, one of them is Mac specific and one of them is um, any operating system. So basically what you can do is the easiest way to do this, you can use iPhoto. If you see that there is a Picasa Web Albums uploader, basically you go to picasa.google.com slash Mac tools or Mac underscore tools dot HTML. And what you do is download this Web Albums uploader tool and install it on your Mac and it will automatically insert itself in iPhoto. So once you get your nice point and shoot camera and take some photos of whatever it is you want to upload, go ahead and view those in iPhoto. And I've got this nice set of photos from a Kingston solid state drive that I purchased with rebate documentation and everything. What you'll do is select the photos that you want to upload after you've installed the uploader and you will go to file export and it'll usually start in the file export window. We'll go over to Picasso Web Albums and perhaps choose a new album. I've already uploaded this one. But you go ahead and choose a new album. And let's just do another one so you can see what it looks like. This will be an unlisted album because it's just going to be going on Craigslist. Nobody else needs to see this. And I always choose better quality because I'm pretty sure the space never runs out on Picasso when you upload with this setting. I think they just keep letting you upload more and more. Um, so then you'll go ahead and press export and wait for the images to be formatted and then uploaded and you'll see it's really quick even if you have a lot of photos it doesn't take too long to get everything up it also doesn't hurt having a 4 megabit upload connection so once you get those uploaded you will go back to the web now Picasa when you look at first is not going to have that album in there but once you upload it it will appear as the first thing in the list. So here are the two photos, if you see this shows two photos that we just uploaded. And if we actually click on that, we will go into that album. Now, the same thing can be accomplished when you're in your Picasso page, just click the upload button and find the photos on your computer. You can do this from any operating system. Just go to picassoweb.google.com and sign in with your Google credentials and then upload your photos any, from anywhere on your hard drive or solid state drive, whatever you have, and you will have your photos on the web ready to go. So once you see your new album created there, go ahead and get into that album. And as you see, you can enlarge each of the photos. And this is the really easy part that makes your Craigslist ads look great. What you want to do is embed this image from Picasso server, not from Craigslist servers, into your Craigslist ad. So you're going to go over to the right side and you see this link to this photo button. Click on that. And I usually suggest if you have two photos, do them both at 400 pixel width a piece. So you'll go choose select size and click on 400 pixels. And I choose to click the image only because that's exactly what we want. We don't want to link back to Picasso. We just want people on Craigslist to see the image. So once you click image only, you're going to go to this link right here and if you see let's see this link I'm sorry the embed image link and all you have to do with these links is just click inside of them it'll highlight the whole thing so click inside the embed image link and copy that you can use a keyboard shortcut or right click and hit copy then going to your Craigslist to add and you can set this up exactly how you'd like once you want to insert a picture in there you're going to do an open caret symbol, type the letters IMG space, and that's the image tag, and then type SRC, which is source, showing where that image is going to be obtained from, equals open quotation marks, and then paste your link in there. Close the quotation marks, and then close the caret. Now you're going to want to enter both pictures in there. I suggest putting one breaking space between both images. So enter a space, and then do the same thing. Open caret, IMG, space, SRC, equals, open quotation marks. Then we will go back 
to our album and click this button to go to the next photo. And we want it to be, this is going to go back to a thumbnail every time you change images. So be sure you click the select size button and choose 400 pixels. You want the image only. So click in this embed image link and copy it. And go back to your Craigslist ad, paste it, and then close the carrot. And if you check this out, let's go ahead and continue. Now you see there's only one image there, so something, there must be a typo somewhere. Oh, I did not close the quotation marks. That's really important. Be sure you close quotation marks after your image link. Now let's take a look at it. There we go. So as you see there, this is much higher quality than anything you would get uploading from the Craigslist uploader. It looks great. It's really easy to achieve and it will definitely get people more seriously interested in your ads. So if you have any other questions, you can leave a comment on this video or check out any of my other articles at caseyfriday.com. If you're having any trouble doing anything else on Craigslist, if you want to learn how to do HTML like this, if you want to put lists on there, if you want to figure out how to best contact people and um, figure out negotiation strategies, I have written a Craigslist guide and you can find the link to this in the description of this video. Um, I call it the best Craigslist guide in the entire world. And you can go to this website, check it out. It's $6.99, so 7 bucks if you're interested in that. And if you don't like it, if you're not absolutely 100% better at Craigslist within 30 days, I'll just give you all your money back. So if you want to check this out, it's at caseyfriday.com, and you'll click on the Craigslist guide here. You'll find it, or you can just hit the link from this video. Thanks for watching.